morning YouTube and welcome back to my channel today we're going to show you something a little bit different we're going to show you how to use launch control on a bike behind me is my buddy Zuki who owns a 2017 Suzuki GSX-R 1000R and it has the launch control feature and Suzuki have actually done a really good job with this feature on the bike so we're going to show you how to set it up and then we're going to show you the comparison between using launch control and without launch control so first step we'll show you how it's set up on the bike okay so in order to get the bike into launch control mode or in launch mode the bike needs to be running so we're, what we're going to do is we're going to start the engine now once the engine is running if you look over here it says a2 the way to put it into launch mode is to hold down the start button for about one second and then once you do that it changes on the screen to ll that means the bike is in launch mode the next thing you're going to do is you're going to pull in the clutch you're going to drop it into first gear and then you're going to pull the throttle all the way back to the max and what's going to happen is the bike is going to hold the revs at 10,000 rpms the next thing you need to do is slowly let out the clutch to manage your launch we're going to show you a demo right now of how exactly this works After several runs, it appears that Zuki managed to achieve a better time without the launch control. This is not to say that the launch control feature doesn't work. Most riders are used to launching their bikes manually. It would be safe to say that with practice using this feature, the timings will improve a lot more and the bike will not bog down like it did in the video. Alright guys, so this is launch control. This is how you activate it and this is how you launch the Suzuki GSX. I want to thank uh, Zuki for coming out here to give us this demo. I hope you've enjoyed the video. If you have any questions, please leave them in the comments. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. And I'll see you next time.